Okay. I think um, since I have school, this will be the end of me making videos for a while. I shouldn't even make this one because I have so much homework to do. But when it comes to um, talking to other Christians on YouTube, um, especially people who oppose what I think, okay, this is, you know, there's a, there's a right way and there's a wrong way to argue or to, um, to make your points on YouTube. Like, when you make comments that say, why did you take down your video? Was it because you were afraid that somebody might oppose you? Are you afraid that I might have a comment? Are you afraid to face me? You worm? I mean, it's not, it's not that you went that far. But as soon as you started to make comments like that, it showed me that you were a troll. You, you want to challenge us, you know, I'm not, I'm not here to have a big fight. If you have, if you want to come to me humbly instead of in your pompous big fat head, okay, and, get, and, and give me your opinion as to why you think that your view is the correct one, then you can come to me and show me, well, I saw your point, but this is what I see in this point. Here's another one. When you have given me your point and I have answered you with a counterpoint, then I'm waiting for your answer and you basically rephrase your point again and present it back to me and say, you see? And I'm going, okay, but what about the counterpoint that I just made? And then when I make a point and I say, well, this is why I disagree with this and what do you think about this, this, and the other thing? And I get, you totally ignored what I said and went back to your original point. It shows me that the arrogance factor is too big and there's no room in the room for me and your big head. God bless.